noon now. It's a local man's dying wish to spend his final days in the arms of his wife. But as he tells us his wife, who's Cambodian, is not being allowed to enter the U.S. Our Amy Fraser met with the man today, and Amy, he's just really running out of time to see his wife again. Yeah, that's right, because he's battling cancer. Doctors have given Ray Crystal a few weeks to a few months to live. He's trying to get his wife here to Portland, but he says the U.S. government is saying no. This is my dying wish to see my wife. Diagnosed with terminal cancer. 62-year-old Ray Crystal struggled to stand after he and his friends were told they'd need a permit to protest outside the federal building. The government stabbed him in the back once and you did it again, you jerks. Move or cancer patient of state. They are angry and frustrated. His wife and daughter applied for a non-immigrant visa. Uh, they were denied. For most of the last 14 years, Crystal has lived in Cambodia. When I got there, of course, I fell in love. Today is his 12-year anniversary with his Cambodian wife, Stina Kim. He also has a stepdaughter there he loves like his own. But times were tough. I couldn't make enough money as a professor there even after 12 years. In late 2013, he says he came to Portland to work for a friend. And shortly after coming back and starting that work, I became very ill. He's been in treatment here for prostate cancer, but the cancer has spread. He's now in hospice. So now at the end of the life, they say, bring your wife and daughter. But his wife in Cambodia received this letter from the U.S. Embassy saying her visa application is denied. And basically it states that uh, she did not uh, demonstrate strong ties to her country. And so they can't guarantee that Cena would return. To find out more, I contacted the U.S. State Department. But I was told visa records are confidential. Crystal says he'll keep fighting, but he doesn't have much time. What would it mean to you to have your wife? There. Well, it means the world to me to die with my wife's arms or have my wife nurturing me as when I'm dying. I mean, what more can a man ask for than their wife and daughter? We have contacted Senator Wyden and Senator Merkley's offices to see if anything can be done. A spokesperson for Senator Merkley tells me their office is trying to work with Ray Crystal to find a way for his family to visit the U.S., we will keep you posted. Yeah, we need to figure out why he was moved from a public sidewalk. We need to look into that. Thank you, Amy.